It's May 2023, so that means that it's time to recap what's going on in the residential real estate market for April of 2023. So if you're interested in buying a home, selling a home, you don't own a home, or you're just curious of what the heck's going on, this video is for you. So right now in all of Orange County, there's only 2,058 properties and that's of May 2nd, this video. Usually in any year pre-COVID, we'd have about 5,800 homes for sale. So what that's creating is fierce competition amongst buyers who are once again, bidding on the small amount of inventory, pushing and stabilizing pricing up because of the lack of inventory. What we've also seen is that the expected market time, that means that when a seller decides to put their home on the market and from the time that it goes into escrow has actually decreased. In January of this year, it was 84 days. Currently, it's only 37 days in all of Orange County, and that's anywhere from your condo to your $20 million estate. What we've also seen is that demand is up 80%. So just over 30 days, we had just about 1,600 homes that were being consumed. Now we have about 2,000 homes. So we have a very low amount of inventory and a very high demand. So buyers in today's market have to act fast. They don't have the luxury of time of seeing multiple properties. They also are jumping on homes that are fairly priced, that have great condition, and they're doing things like bidding up the home, removing certain contingencies of inspection and appraisal. And once again, its market is acting very similar to how it was in 2021, but the only difference is, is the interest rates were 3%, not 6.5%. So the bottom line is that in every community, we have lack of for sale signs, and that's gonna continue throughout the summer and into the winter market. And it might even continue into the following year because 70% of all homeowners that have a mortgage on their home have an interest rate of less than 4%. So there's very little chance that a seller wants to sell their home unless they're retiring, moving out of state, or they really need to expand or shrink their footprint. So we think that inventory will remain very low, which will keep demand high and also keep pricing stable. So if you're a buyer and you're watching this, you're thinking, why would I even get into competition? Well, here's the reason is that if interest rates, like we do think will drop, well, if they were to drop 1%, the affordability would create that much more buyer and demand would go through the roof. Like I said, is we're not gonna have as much inventory come to the market because 70% of all homeowners that have a mortgage have a 4% or less interest rate. Now, if you're a seller, this isn't a time to get crazy. You still need to have a great marketing plan, price your home at fair market value, and you will participate with multiple offers and get the price that you want. So if you have any questions about this video or any of our videos, share or like it, please do so, or DM us below.